Welcome to another Take 5 with Nige. We haven't done one for a long, long time. Cheers, T for Frosty. No, T for Nige. Hashtag <laughs> T for Frosty. Oh dear. Anyway, rambling. This is my new lid. It's a cask mojito. And you're all wondering, Nige, what with the B-twin? The B-twin stuff, I still swear by. I just wanted to treat myself to something a little different. So it's a special occasion and this is what I was allowed to buy. <laughs> nice isn't it? I love it. It does bear a resemblance to a certain uh, certain cycling kit that's, uh, that's going about. <laughs> I haven't a clue which one I'm talking about. Anyway, so that's the new lid. Cask Mojito. Love it. Uh, I didn't do an unboxing for this because it just the time I got it and, and I hadn't done any um, I, I completely forgot yeah if you've seen the video from the Norfolk trip sporting the new lid already anyway let's get on with this one new take 5 with Nige what's in the name tarmac softy let me tell you about tarmac softy someone asked me not too long ago and I've been asked on numerous occasions in the past Tarmac Softy. What's Tarmac Softy? Did I work for Tarmac? Did I used to lay roads? Did I work for a road engineering company? No, none of that whatsoever. It actually comes from when I first started mountain biking. I suppose from my history. Um, not a lot of people are aware of it. I don't think a lot of people when they watch my videos are aware of it. But this is my second generation at cycling, if you like. There was a time before. There was a time before when I was uh, in my early teens, late teens, early 20s. And I was uh, doing a little time trial in. A lot of club rides, or various club rides. And that took it quite seriously however that was all road work there was no mountain bikes and um, fast forward a bit when some colleagues at work decided that they wanted to go out mountain biking and we all got bikes either borrowed or whatever we were all in this long line of cyclists and I was right at the back yeah <laughs> as usual and um, uh, a friend and, and former colleague of mine turned around and shouted come on you tarmac softy and that was it basically I thought that was a cracking name and I've used it ever since as uh, usernames on goodness knows what um, so you know you can google it and tarmac softy will come up all over google but yeah that's basically it nothing any more extravagant than someone shouting at me come on you tarmac softy anyway i don't know if that was five minutes or what but uh, i hope you enjoyed that little little history lesson anyway next monday there'll be another take five with nige i'm working on doing these every monday night uh so yeah Look forward to seeing you again in the Room of Despair. Remember, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, what the hell are you playing at? Click the subscribe button. And whatever you do, have a great week. Stay safe, enjoy your cycling or whatever it is you get up to. And I'll see you in the next video.